hi everyone in this video i will be showing you how you guys can apply different color scheme to your website so i have designed this uh, project in my previous video so you guys can download this project from my github page link will be in the description and i will be using uh, these color palettes from this website so link will be in the description to this website as well and also there is the this is the other one which is uh, also very cool so i have opened this uh, project with a vs code okay and i have used this color scheme uh, in my previous video so i'm going to copy this and i'm going to paste it okay so i'm going to go to this color website color hunt website sorry and i'm going to scroll down so I'm gonna try this uh, color palette. So I will be using this uh, dark blue color uh, for the background and the sidebar overlay. Okay, and uh, I'm gonna pick this one or this one for the brand color. So for now, let me copy this. Okay, and here I'm gonna create another variable. So I'm gonna name this uh, F for now and i'm gonna click on this and i'm gonna change the hexa value to hsl okay so this will be one value and uh, for the brand color uh let me pick this one and i'm gonna change this letter if uh color is not looking good so i'm gonna change this to hsl as well okay so this is the background color one value background two and this is the brand value and the sidebar value I have uh, generated from this from this value as well so for the hue and saturation I have used the same value and then I I decrease the lightness to uh, 10 okay so I'm gonna copy this I'm gonna select these first two control D Okay, and I'm gonna paste it okay so the lightness is 46 so I'm gonna change this to 46 and for the BG2 I'm gonna change this to 56 okay and uh, for the sidebar I'm gonna increase this to let's say 30 and uh, for the body is okay and for the heading is okay and then I'm gonna copy this so this will be our brand uh, color so i'm going to copy and i'm going to hit ctrl d and i'm going to paste it okay and so this will be the lightness will be 70 percent and this will be let's say 82 or 80. okay i'm going to hit ctrl s i'm going to save it and uh, let's see okay so as you can see uh i think it is not looking good uh so let me try this this color is a brand color so i'm gonna paste it right here i'm gonna change this i'm gonna copy i'm gonna hit ctrl d i'm gonna paste it save it and uh, let's see I think this this one is looking a little bit okay but uh, I'm not satisfied with the result so let me try another color scheme so I'm gonna scroll down and uh, yeah this one will be looking good if I choose this value or uh, this color as a background color and uh, this one is a brand color okay so this will be looking good and yeah this one so let me select this one okay so this will be for the background and this will be for the brand color <clears throat> so i'm gonna paste it so this will be for the background and this will be the brand color so let me generate the hsl value okay so i'm gonna copy this i'm gonna select first two hit ctrl d i'm gonna paste it and 
the lightness will be 39 for the background color and for the background 2 will be 50 uh, let's say 49 okay and let me copy the brand color first uh, the first two okay so I'm gonna select these two control D and I'm gonna paste it so the lightness is 53 so I'm gonna change this to 53 so this will be 63 save it and uh, let's see yep I think th this one is looking a little bit better from the previous one yep I think that this one is looking okay so let me try another one okay so let me find a very beautiful one uh, if I try this one so let me give it a try I think this one and uh, this one is looking the same so these two color and if I use this one as a brand color video uh, sorry the brand color how it would be okay so I'm gonna leave uh, that one and I'm, I'm gonna use this one so I'm gonna use this one as a background color and this is the brand color so let me copy this so I'm gonna comment this and I'm gonna paste it right here so I'm gonna try this one so this will be for the other uh, background color uh, let me change this so this will be our brand color okay so I'm gonna copy this video so <clears throat> so I'm gonna uh, decrease the darkness uh, sorry the lightness to let's say uh, 30 let's say 20 and I'm gonna copy this this will be for the background too and I'm gonna increase the background to color the sorry the lightness for the background to to let's say 30 and for the brand color I'm gonna copy this control D I'm gonna paste it and also I'm gonna change this the body color and the sidebar color as well so I'm gonna copy this control D paste it wow well, look at this now this this one is looking very nice I think so for let me decrease the darkness to the 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 overlay for the sidebar so yep. so let me decrease this to let's say 20 let's say 10 yep 10 is looking fine wow this one is looking very cool okay so guys let me uh find the last one and i will leave uh, i will leave it as it is and you guys can try these different colors so let me find another one so i'm gonna scroll down and let me find another one okay so let me let me try this one so I'm gonna copy this so I'm gonna comment this okay so I'm gonna copy this video so this will be for the background and sidebar and this one this will be the brand color alright so I'm gonna 
click and convert this to HSL value. Okay, so I'm going to copy this. Hit Control D, paste it, and so the likeness is fifty one percent. So this will be sixty one. And I'm going to copy this value for the brand. So I'm going to scroll down, and here is it is. So I'm going to click these two, Control D. I'm going to paste it, and uh, let me see. not looking good so I'm gonna de decrease the lightness so so it is 51 so I'm gonna set this to let's say 21 it's going to be 31 save it and refresh now it is looking good look at this oh looking cool so this is the the default one and this is these are the one that i have applied this color scheme and you guys can try uh, different colors and you will see the result okay guys so that's it for this video and uh, thank you for watching and see you in the next video